just like that. Drop those. Let me go like that. Hold up. I'm doing this. Alright. Well, before I start. Alright. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another movie review. Um, Halloween 4, The Return of Michael Myers. Uh, this takes place 10 years. If I'm wrong, uh, hold up. Okay, I'm not wrong. Takes 10, takes, uh, takes place 10 years and um yeah this is the most Halloween movie that feels like a Halloween movie to me feels like a Halloween movie to me the movie's great I, I think the mask is good I just don't know why people shit on the mask I I, I really do not know after this movie review I'm doing Halloween 5 I mean yeah but um yeah so starts off with the title card or whatever you want to call it then, you see them transporting Michael Myers in the ambulance. Michael Myers kills them with... Well, somehow Michael Myers survives. Then, Dr. Loomis is alive somehow. And then, Michael Myers kills this guy by pushing his thumb in his head. Which is pretty cool. And, um, yeah. And you see Jamie... No, wait, hold on. Jamie Lloyd, whatever the fuck her name is, sent by the window her dog. And she sees the ambulance outside. Which is a hallucination. But really, the ambulance, like, um, crashed, like, near a bridge. And then Dr. Loomis hears about it. Then he goes to check it out. The um, officer says their, the bodies are chewed up. And then after that, he's going to Haddonfield. Uh, and he said, like, huh. uh, Dr. Loomis gets to this gas station. Well, Michael already did. Kills the guy, steals his overalls. And, um, I guess Michael's next objective is getting the mask, but, uh, Dr. Loomis finds the body by hanging up with chains, I guess. And, uh, Dr. Loomis goes to the front of it. The phone is, like, broken, I believe, or, like, down. And then, she's my soul. And he's saying, like, God damn you, and shooting with the, um... But, I don't, I don't think... The gun sound effects are like shit. But, uh. Then another scene. Uh, then Michael comes out with the fucking truck. Blows everything up. Dr. Loomis gets down. Blows everything up. The power line even co fucking comes down. And you just see Michael go going down the street with the truck. And, uh. I guess it cuts back to Jamie being bullied, or what do you want to call it? Because her uncle is Michael Myers. And, uh, they go to the mask shop, or clothes shop. I don't know what the fuck you want to call it, like, uh, where you get mat where you get, like, Halloween costumes. I don't know. And, um, Jamie's looking at costumes. Rachel doesn't give a fuck. Uh, she's too busy making out with, uh, whatever the fuck his name is. And he's a cheater, too. And, um... Uh... Jamie finds the clown costume that Michael killed then when he was a child. <laughs> Michael picks the mask. Well, he already... Then picks the mask um, he wants. Or, or he did. Puts it on behind Jamie. Jamie gets freaked out, starts screaming and shit, and then Michael's looking at her like, 
tone just has like a little bit to like uh left a little bit and uh breaks the mirror which Michael Myers was in the reflection and Jamie decides to go with that costume anyway don't know why because at the end of the movie you know what fucking happens but I'll get to that in a little while okay so we um pick it back up where Dr. Loomis was trying to find a ride like hitchhiking the fucking cheerleaders you want to call them in the car Tell him, come on, we, you, we can pick you up, and then gets dirt in his fucking face, which is pretty rude. Yeah, to the old man. Then Dr. Loomis finds an, another old man, which is like, um, like a, I, 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 I don't know what you want to call it. Like, he likes God, I guess, and he's like hunting for some shit, and they, they get along, then... After that, Dr. Loomis goes to Haddonfield. Hold on, I gotta f remember. Oh, yeah, it picks up um, Halloween night where they're trick or treating. And Dr. Loomis goes to the sheriff's office telling them the little girl will die if uh, they don't help her. And, uh, uh, they're looking around for Michael and shit. And supposedly, uh, they find, I guess, three or four guys dressed up in Michael Myers costumes. Michael Myers costumes. And, um, Dr. Loomis thinks that it's them. But it's not. And then, meanwhile, you look behind. Well, um, while they drive off, you see Michael, My actual Michael Myers standing behind them, which is creepy. And, uh, they go to, like, a house, I believe, the house, yeah, the house, and, uh, they tell him to lock the doors and shit. And, uh, meanwhile, oh, his name's fucking Brady. Meanwhile, Brady's having sex with this other girl. And, uh, they kind of, like, get caught, I believe. I don't know why there's always has to be a sex in this fucking movie, in the movies, but. And, uh, people are looking around for Michael Myers, I guess, and telling them the kids are getting picked up and shit. And, uh, I gotta fucking remember. Meanwhile, um, back at the house, the cop is dead. Um, the girl that fucked Brady gets a shotgun through her fucking chest. Or gets killed by a shotgun. And, uh, Rachel discovers the body, screams, and Brady tries getting, um, them out of the house by shooting it. Which doesn't do shit. Kick the fucking door down, bro. And, uh. They have no good luck at that. So, um. Michael Myers is like. Well, Rachel finds Jamie. And she's like gone. And then. The other time she comes back. Uh, and, uh. Michael Myers is, um. Downstairs, and Brady's telling him to go. And Michael Myers picks up Brady by um, pushing his fingers in his face, which is cool. Oh, I forgot about that one part. And then there's another part where Michael's at this like uh, electric place, or we're gonna call it, where all the lights in the city, I guess. And the guy's like, "Don't try to help me." on me. He's like, alright, stay here. I'm gonna call the cops. And then Michael Myers walks up behind him, throws him against the fucking thing and then electrocutes him. Takes all the um, town's light out. And, uh... Yeah, the, meanwhile, they're on the roof um, trying to get out of there. Michael Myers gets on it somehow. 
which he's a fucking boss genius. And um, he's chasing them. But Rachel does not end up dying. She's still alive. Uh, then Rachel lower, lowers Jamie down. She gets like, th well, Rachel's like trying to stay on as best she can while Michael Myers is trying to like cut her fingers and shit. And um, she falls. And then Jamie thinks she's dead, but Jamie's being chased by Michael. And um, Dr. Loomis gets her, and they're going to the school. Uh, meanwhile, Dr. Loomis is trying to, like, open the doors and, I guess, trying to get out of there, I guess. I don't fucking know. I watched the video last night. Uh, and I think all of them said they were tired at this point, so they um, put on the pink mask, and Dr. Loomis got thrown through the fucking glass or door. And, uh, yeah. And then, Michael Myers is there on top of the stairs. And, um, Rachel comes out with a fucking, I guess, fire extinguisher and then knocks someone. I don't know where he went, but then, I guess the hillbilly is the one with trucks and shotguns and shit. Pick them up, then... Um, I guess, like, part of the movie is, like, uh, them riding in the truck. There's one part where it's, like, all foggy, and Michael Myers comes up, kill the pe kills the um guys in the back, which throws them off, throws them off, then, because Ma Michael's trying to get Jamie and then Rachel, and, uh... Um, the dude's neck gets ripped, like, to the point where you can see it, blood gushing, and then, uh, uh, Michael gets thrown off the car, then hit into, like, I guess an old mine shaft place, they start, Jamie goes over there for some weird ass reason, picks his hand up, and then, they start shooting at him, and then Michael falls back, and then it doesn't show him in the mine shaft yet. That's until Halloween Five, and uh, um, meanwhile, and at the back at their house, James getting ready for a bath, and then she kills her stepmother or whatever you want to call it. And the doctor is like, no, no. And then it ends with her holding the knife with blood all over her face. And the music starts playing. And um, that's the end of the movie. Uh, I'm probably going to give this one. Uh, because it feels like Halloween to me. The most Halloween movie feels like that to me. Uh, probably. Um, a 9.8. Yeah. I'm. 9.8, and it's just the reason, the reason why I'm giving it 9.8 because it just feels like a Halloween movie to me, and it feels like the most fallest, or if they even make sense, but um, yeah, hope y'all enjoyed.